Flight 15 now departing from gate 3. Flight 15 now departing from gate 3. Airport is under attack by Dr. Wiley's robots. We need help immediately. Calling Mega Man. We're calling Mega Man. Please help us. Looks like Dr. Wiley and his slime buckets are at it again. And I think we used to work together. You must be stopped, Mega Man. Right. I'm out of here. Huh? Yeah, we're out of here. Whoa. Where are you going? With you. Not a chance, Fancy Pants. I don't need any girl robots getting in my way. You mean you don't want a girl robot showing you up? Forget it, Roll. It's too dangerous. Come on, Rush. Into action. Yeah, 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 yeah. Woof, woof. Hey, don't forget your energy cans, Mega Man. Thanks, Eddie. Let's jet out of here. Hurry, Mega Man. Dr. Wily's robots are taking over the control tower. Mega Man's gonna need my help whether he needs it or not. Men are all the same. Even the robots. Hang on, Doc! We're going full throttle! Chips into your robots, Dr. Wily. Now I have to rebuild all men again. I'll blessed Mega Man to pieces. No! I must destroy Mega Man. He's my brother. You remember I built you, Proto Man. And you will obey me. You're right, Dr. Wily. I'll obey you when I want to. Can I implant some humble chips into that boy? Let's see how fancy your powers are against me, Mega Jerk. I'm as good or better than you, Proto Man. We'll see about that. He really went to pieces. Come on, Doc, this is easy. Cut her. Let's crush her. With pleasure, Gutsman. <laughs> Mega Man's crap! 
crash like a rooster on the town of steel. <laughs> these messages. We now return to Mega Man. We need help! Where's Doc? <laughs> we gotta get Mega Man back to Dr. Light! <laughs> Finished the airport is ours. <laughs> and with no air transportation, the city will soon come to its knees. <laughs> it's all Dr. Light's fault. If he never invented robots, none of this would ever have happened. It's all my fault, Dr. Light. I never should have gone. Mega Man was doing what he was programmed to do. Save lives. Oh, Eddie should have given him more energy cans. Is he gonna be okay? I don't know, Roy, but we'll do everything we can. It's my father. I'm a little boy. What's he saying, Dr. Light? His electrical brain must be shorting in and out, and he's dreaming of the past. How well I remember. Dr. Wiley was my assistant then. I've just finished my first prototype robot. If he works, Dr. Wiley, this will just be the first of many. Tja, the world of robots. Together, we can create hundreds of industrial and domestic robots. Construction robots, mining robots, marine robots, and all to help mankind. Now for the big moment. It's working, Dr. Light. Something must be wrong. Stop! I command you to stop! He doesn't obey! There must be a problem with his computer guidance system. We'll have to rebuild this prototype. But I programmed the system, Dr. Light. It must be something else. No, I'm sure it's the guidance system. We must destroy the plans and start over. Yes, of course, Dr. Light. You're right as always. I'll destroy the plans. Just what I'm looking for. Destroy my work, will he? Not if I can help it. What are you doing with those plans, Dr. Wiley? You were supposed to destroy them. Never! You're just jealous of my genius! You probably sabotaged the guidance system, so you could take all the credit! But now, it's my turn to be in the spotlight. Come back! You can't use those plans! They are dangerous! Let them make fun of me. Let them laugh. Nobody knows the genius I am. Even when I was a little boy, the other children never understood me. I never even had toys like the other kids. And now I'll build all the toys I want! Robot toys! And I'll control them! <laughs> Humans are imperfect. Robots are so much superior. My robots will be made to supervise mankind under my command. I think I've finally worked out all the bugs. I'll call him Rock, my new robot prototype. Now, let's see if he works. Hi, my name's Rock. Who are you? I'm Dr. Light. I built you. Are you my father? In a sense, I am. I look human. Yes, and I programmed you to feel like a human. I like that. Come, Rob. Look, I built this robot to handle household chores. Her name is Rome. She's pretty. Yes. And you can think of her as your sister. Hi, I'm Rock, your brother. I'm Raw. We're one big family. 
and the two of you are going to help me as I create a whole new world. This is Cutman, a logging robot. And this is Gutsman, a construction robot. He has enormous strength. And this one can freeze anything with his ice slasher beam. Just think of all the great things they can do to help mankind. Yes. But it's late, and time for young robots to get to bed. The three robots are in the next room. Magnificent. Oh, they will do nicely as the first in my army. Dr. Wiley. What are you doing back here? Just settling an old score. They're going to take a robot, Dr. Light! Not if I can help it. Stop them, my robots! No, Dr. Light! Save me! me. We obey you, Dr. Wiley. He's reprogrammed! They will make a perfect addition to my collection of robots. And I wouldn't try anything, Dr. Light. If you do, Iceman will freeze you. Show the doctor, Iceman. If you try and follow, then let Cartman show you what he'll do to you. Yes, I know. But why would Dr. Wiley want rock and roll? And what are they going to do with them? Programs him to turn against mankind. <laughs> but that's not right. Oh my! He's right, Proto Man. I'm a bad scientist. <laughs> hey, you should be happy, Rock. You and I are brothers. We were built from the same plans. Let Doctor Wiley reprogram you and join us in our quest to control mankind. No way, you can count me out. Me little dog here, a little slice there. Won't you feel differently about this? Oh, hold it, Dr. Deadhead! It's Dr. Wiley! Not in my universe, Buster! You'll be a pleasure to revile. Wait, stop! And why should I stop? Only if you want to live. My dad also built Super Warrior robots, and they're on their way here to rearrange your ugly anatomy. They're mean machines. Robots can't lie. He must be telling the truth. But why didn't I know about these other robots? Is there a way to stop them? Let us go, and I'll show you. Unstrap him. Thanks, Doc. Now. Tell me how to stop those robots. Simple. First, you grab hold of one of these, like this, and then you shove it at them, like this! See? It works every time. You tricked us! But, but robots can't lie! I think we overstayed our welcome. Let's get out of here! Get us out of this! Get that 
blue bucket of bolts yet. And then he'll be on our side. Are you mad at me? I had to tell a fib to get away. Well, not this time, Rock. You saved you and your sister's life. It was your human emotions that enabled you to make that escape. But there's still a grave problem. Dr. Wiley and Proto Man will be back. And there's only one way to stop them. What is it, Father? I'm going to have to rebuild you into a great robot warrior. And with your mixture of conscience, compassion, and self-determination, you'll always have an edge over other robots. Imagine my brother a super warrior. He's beautiful. He's the greatest creation of my career. And I will call him Mega Man. Mega Man. I like it. But you're also my son, Rock. And I've got an added surprise for you. This is Rush. He's going to be your canine companion and transportation. Mega, mega. Hey, 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 come on. Stop with the licking. Let's see what you can do. As you can see, he's got an unlimited amount of vehicles he can transform into. <laughs> yeah, he's one hunk of hardware. Hey, good boy. I just feed him these battery biscuits for energy. <laughs> oh. Hey, the two of us are going to make a great team. Uh-uh. The three of us. Hang on. My robot transistor sends something coming. While Dr. Light was rebuilding you, Mega Man, I did some work on myself. Oops. I guess I still need a few adjustments. But now I can help you when you go into battle, Mega Man. Hey, no way. Forget it. You're out of your gourd, sis. We'll make a great team. Just me, Rush, and Mega Man. 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 Mega Man, wake up. Dr. Light, roll, Rush. He's okay. You fixed him, Dr. Light. We were worried for a while. I gotta get back to the airport and stop Dr. Wily and Proto Man. What about me? Okay, hop on. I've learned you don't listen when I tell you to stay put, so I might as well have you where I can keep an eye on you. Wait, this time maybe bring you double order of energy cans. Huh? Huh? Okay, thanks. Let's go. My face will appear all over the city. <laughs> I'm in control now. Nothing can stop me. Now, it's time for the mayor of the city to surrender. No! Stop me, command at all costs. Mega 
man's mind. I'll take care of him myself. are over, Proto Man. I'm taking you back to Dr. Light's lab. He'll reprogram you to be good. <laughs> Make a man do that again! But that blue dweeb hasn't seen the last of us. My robots have almost finished repairing the air, Mr. Mayor. The city offers its congratulations, Mega Man, for our job well done. The credit goes to all of us. Even me? Even you, Roll. And my faithful robot dog, Rush. Hey, fetch, Rush! Sometimes I'm not too sure Rush's circuits are wired correctly. <laughs> hey, boy, come on! <laughs> Stay tuned! We'll be right back after these messages.